because it was a beautiful day to take a drive, why not drive to the most southern place in all of Canada, Point Pelee, Ontario. And just ever so slightly north of that most southern point of all of Canada is Windsor, Ontario, which is right across the Detroit River from Detroit, Michigan. And you know what's in Windsor? The Essex Terminal Railway. The Essex Terminal Railway, having been founded in the year 1902, is one of the oldest existing railways in Canada. It was founded as the western connection of the Grand Trunk Railway to factories in the east end of Windsor. The Essex Terminal operates on about 34 kilometers or 21 miles of track and they have four units in their roster. Let's watch them do a little bit of switching. This engine, a GP9, used to be Essex Terminal number 102, but it was recently sold to the Ontario Southland Railway. It's photographed here in Putman, Ontario, on the OSR. Now, just because you've seen the locomotives, don't fly off just yet, because I wanted to show you the Essex Railway Station. According to this plaque, the Essex Railway Station was built in 1887 by the Michigan Central Railway, and it was the only station of stone construction on the Canada Southern Railway. The station was only 20 years old when, in 1907, a boxcar loaded with nitroglycerin exploded right in front of the building. This building continued to serve the community as a train station until the year 1979 when the very last passenger train rolled through town. The CN Freight Service continued until 2012 when the rail ties and steel tracks were removed. This photograph from 1983 shows the station after it was not being used for passenger service anymore but still had the tracks in front for freight. Today you can visit the station, which is now a museum, in its original location, and it is surrounded not by railroad tracks, but by a parkland setting. One last photo before you go. So this photograph was taken in August of 1983, and it is the Essex Terminal Railway C420 number 106, which began life as the Lehigh and Hudson River number 22 and it is shown here while stopped waiting for track to be lined up at the entrance to Ojibwe Yard. This locomotive would put in a little more than four more years before being sold to the Arkansas and Missouri line as their number 50, after toiling 16 years on the Essex Terminal Railway. 
Like this and want to see more? Subscribe to this channel and you'll get to see all the latest videos. Don't forget to push like and share. Thank you so much.